I hope you give me an A. <laughs> give me an A. House call providers is a really excellent place to work. Basically, we're nurse practitioners, doctors, and physician's assistants that do primary care based in the home. And I think this is the wave of the future to have home-based primary care. Hi, this is Amy from House Call Providers. Hello, I'm just calling about Lillian and see how she's doing with the UTI. As an employee, I feel like there's a lot of flexibility because I'm really making my own schedule. You know, I'm seeing a patient and determining when I think I need to see them next. So really, I'm making my own schedule. If I need to schedule a day off or something, I just I just do it. Which medicine are you talking about? The Parkinson's medicine? Yes, I'm not. This is actually an ideal first job for um, a new nurse practitioner or physician assistant. You can really learn to pace yourself, you learn to time yourself, and the pressures you put on yourself is not from the organization, it's from your own, like how much money that you think you want to make and how much um, you want to get done in a particular day. There are some days where I have all of my patients are in the same place, you know, I can see a whole bunch of people in one day, and then there are days where I'm seeing, you know, people in houses individually, so I'm doing more driving on those days. Herman is someone that didn't want anything done ever. In fact, when I first started taking care of you, the other nurse said he doesn't want to do anything at all, but maybe ask him if he wants a flu <laughs> shot. He's always going to say he doesn't want anything. It's really good if you like driving and you like spending a lot of time with patients and getting to know them. How's your sister doing? Doing sassy as ever. She's she worried about you like always? Her daughter was, at, at, was here. Oh yeah? You know, just by being able to see them in their own environment um, and, you know, see them as frequently as you need to, trying to keep them out of the hospital, we're a little bit more successful, I think. I look forward to her coming. Yeah. Yeah, to check me out and see if I'm doing all, all right. There's a really good supportive framework in the organization for whatever path that you want to take. We have Monday morning meetings, um, and then at that point, we, you know, it's just that's when we get sort of get together and we can discuss how our week's been and sort of check in with one another. As a clinician, you get to decide um, how many patients you care for. You get to decide how often your patients, how often to see your patients. You get to decide how long to spend with each patient. Next month, I'll come and check in. Very good. It's just made all the difference in the world to me. Yeah. I love her smile. Oh, look at that. Isn't that wonderful? Oh, That's don't great. do that. No, no I did not. Sorry. <laughs> to be able to see an individual at 90 and, and how much of a rich life they've lived, you know, and then to be able to care for them at the end of their life is just really, I think, a really, um, it's a really, it's an honor.